Hey Trail Riders, welcome back to the Daily Ride. I hope you guys are doing well. Today we're going to be talking about above the ordinary, our connecting passage, or our power passage for today is Acts 6 5, which says, They chose Stephen, a man full of faith and the Holy Spirit. Connecting passages for today is Acts 6 8 through 15 and Acts 7 55 through 60. The scriptures that get us through the Bible in a year is Genesis 9 through 12 and Matthew chapter 3. God has privileged us in Jesus to live an, above, an ordinary human plane of life. Those who want to be ordinary and live in a lower plane can do so. But as for me, I will not. This same anointing, this same zeal, the same Holy Spirit power is at our command as it is and was at the command of Stephen and the apostles. We have the same God that Abraham and Elijah had. And we need, do not need to lag behind in receiving any gift or grace. We may not possess all the gifts as abiding gifts, but as we are full of the Holy Spirit and divine anointing, it is possible when there is a need God for God to make evident every gift of the Spirit through us as He may choose. Stephen, an ordinary man, became extraordinary under the Holy Spirit's anointing until in many ways he stands supreme among the apostles. Then Stephen, full of faith and power, did great wonders and signs among the people at Acts 6-8. As we go deeper in God, in our relationship with Him, He enlarges our capacity for understanding and places before us an ever-widening door. An open door. It is not surprising that this man chose to serve tables was later called to a higher plane. You may ask, what do you mean? Did he stop taking care of his responsibilities? No, but he was lost in the power of God. He lost sight of everything in the natural and steadfastly fixed his gaze on Jesus, the author and the finisher of our faith, as Paul tells us in Hebrews 12, 2, until he was transformed into a shining light in the kingdom of God. May we be awakened to believe his word and to understand the mind of the Spirit. For there is an inner place of purity where we can see God. Stephen was an ordinary person, but he was in the place where God could move him so that he, in turn, could affect those around him. He began to place humble, began in an humble, humble place and ended in a blaze of glory. Dare to believe in Jesus. I want to close today with a thought for today. Choose for menial service, Stephen became mighty for the service of God. God bless you guys. I hope you'll continually follow me here on the daily ride. And I'll see you on the next trail ride.